This is problem number seven from section 2.2. It says, suppose that a lawn can be raked by one gardener in five hours and by a second gardener in four hours. How long will it take the two gardeners to rake the lawn working together? So the first thing you want to look at in this problem uh, is you want to kind of break this down into uh, how fast one gardener does something per hour. So we have, uh, let's, let's, let's define a, var a variable. First of all, x is going to equal, we're going to call x the total time to rake. Okay, so if x is the total time to rake, to rake we're going to have first gardener and the second gardener. For the first gardener, if x is the total time to rake, then this gardener, because this gardener takes five hours to rake it, uh, this gardener is essentially uh, doing one-fifth of the job each hour. If it takes you five hours to do something, then each hour you're doing one-fifth of that job. So we could write an expression. So maybe we can write this as an express. We're going to say expression of the first gardener, expression of the second gardener. And that expression for the first gardener is one-fifth of the total time is equal to one hour. Okay? Now for the second gardener, if we look at its expression, and we could really call that, that's really an equation. I was referring the expression to just this part, but uh, if we, this is essentially an equation, right? Uh, the second gardener then uh, does in four hours. Well, if you're doing a job in four hours, you're doing one-fourth of that job, right? One-fourth of that job, one-fourth of the total time is going to equal, well, that's going to be one hour. So if I want to combine this together into one problem to figure out how long it takes this person to uh, rate these two people to rake together, all I've got to do is take this equation and combine it with this equation essentially. Well, I know it takes this gardener one-fifth of the total time. Uh, it takes it, he's essentially working at one-fifth or one-fifth of the total time. Uh, each hour and this one's working one-fourth each hour so I can write an, an equation <clears throat> that looks like this one-fifth of the total time plus one-fourth of the total time is equal to what these two gardeners can do in an hour because this person can do one-fifth of the work in an hour this person can do a fourth in an hour so if you took this person's fifth plus this person's fourth working at the same time obviously uh, they would get this much done in an hour. So now we can go ahead and solve this problem. So we can take one-fifth x plus one-fourth x. We can find a common denominator. That would be uh, 4 over 20x plus 5 over 20x equals one hour. That gives you 9 over 20x equals one hour. And then we can divide each side by 9 over 20. So we divide by 9 over 20. Divide this by 9 over 20. Well, when you divide a fraction, you know, you flip and you multiply. So you end up with x equals 20 over 9. This would be 20 over 9 hours, right? Which actually equates to x equals, if you divide that, that's 2.22 hours. So when they work together, the one person does it in five hours, the other person does it in four, but when they work together, they actually do it in just over two, which should make sense because if they both worked, uh, if they both were at the same pace, a four-hour pace, uh, they would do it in exactly half the time, which would be two hours. But this person's a little slower, so that's why it's a little higher than two.